Hey, it's Marcel from Career Valet, where our writing services allow 93% of our clients to get interviews within a few weeks. And I want to talk to you about confidence at work. Um, and it's, you know, always a touchy subject, but I think a lot of us assume that if things aren't going well, that it's somehow our fault or that we didn't perform well enough or we're not as smart as this person or we just didn't work as hard as that person and didn't get that promotion. And in reality, you really need to go back to this very fact, which is you got selected for this job because you were determined to be the best person for that job. So keep that in mind anytime you find yourself having negative thoughts about your current situation and realize that maybe you just need to be out there showing your capabilities in a different or new way. Um, and really to showcase your strengths and find ways, you know, even if it's in a, on a different team or volunteering for a different kind of project that will help you showcase those strengths to help you get where you want to go. I thought I read this um, book by Carla Harris, who is a Wall Street executive and been doing coaching for a long time called Expect to Win. And uh, I found some of her talk about this and quotes really to be impactful, um, which is that if people are making you feel that way or actually literally putting you down at work, it is out of insecurity. And I think a lot of times we don't realize that and we look in ourselves and we blame ourselves um, for it. But in reality, she says, insecure people are extremely difficult to work for because they are preoccupied with being found out. So if you think about it that way, you might realize that some of the insecurities you're having are stemming from someone else's insecurities and making you feel that way. Now, if it's different and you feel like this person, this is just a situation that's not able to be remedied and I've tried all these things, I've demonstrated my strengths and yet I can't get beyond this, then maybe there is something that needs to be done. You might have to choose to leave or really you know, take a step back and look at what the right thing for you is if you find you can advance and do the things you wanna do where you're at. But in a lot of cases, it can be that we're beating ourselves up when it's in fact other people's insecurities that are seemingly bringing us down or our own. And when we go back to that original point that you were hired because you were the deemed the best person for the job, that can give us the confidence to go out and seek new opportunities to show our strengths. If you'd like more tips, click below to sign up for our bi-monthly newsletter at careervalet.com.